Dennis, you're supposed to introduce the part. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's my job to introduce the part. Damn it, I keep forgetting that. Hello and welcome back, everyone, uh, to uh, Crash Bandicoot 2 Cortex Strikes Back Part 18. And in this episode, we're going back into one of the sewer levels in order to get the shit that I missed on our on our, uh, on our our normal playthrough as we Dead. were in the Insane Trilogy. See, the slime barrels are not... They're actual slime barrels now. They contain radioactive waste. From Oogie Boogie's fucking Whereas doofy. Whereas before they were just nitro barrels. Yes. Basically. And they also produced the didgeridoo death sequence, which I don't even think they do the didgeridoo in this in this one. Really? Yeah. Man? Now let's see. Do, which gem do you need? In, I think We're not going after the box gem. We're going after... So I think you took, the, you took the hidden exit out of this place when you did it. So you couldn't have gotten the box gem. Right, so, yeah, we're going for the box gem, then. Fuck yeah. Whee! You see, that's a death, that's a death call in the, uh, in the original one, whereas in, whereas now it's, uh, just an added sound effect. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah, they, they would only play that if you actually died there. Wah, 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 wah! Oh, they're they're fine. Oh, they're fine, Where? Ass Cloud. You can you see, pretty easy to dodge those. It's these that are the assholes. Yeah. Uh, but I think I think they're uh, I think they take up slightly less space than they did, um, uh, in uh the uh the original release. Oh boy. Yeah. It looks like they do. It's also getting the right jump height. Or maybe their hitbox are slightly better defined. I'm thinking roast that bandicoot tonight. <laughs> it's just for me. No, uh, we are not Crocodile Dundee. Also, Crash will kick Crocodile Dundee's ass. <laughs> did you see the uh, death battle with uh, Crash v Spyro? I did not, but I did see the... I did see the battle between... Uh... No, I, I, think, it was I think it was a Superman battle, now that I think of it. No, so that would have been Superman v Goku. Was it one or two? The first one. Okay. There are still people that think that Goku can beat Superman. These people are idiots. Man of Steel needs to be whacked around a lot more than that. Well, just... it's more or less the fact that uh, you see that's yeah that was a secret exit that that I took. Um, it's still there. It's more or less the fact that as long as the battle is on Earth, Superman can't realistically lose. Yeah, of course. He's fucking indestructible. Goku. On Earth. Goku that, bleeds. That's one of the... Uh, G Goku does bleed, and that's a pretty and that's a pretty major problem, because Superman uh, chooses if he oh. bleeds or not. Uh, oh, oh, god, god damn it. God, god, god damn it. Am I am I fucked? I don't rem oh I know why I don't remember this bonus room. I barely ever take this path. I always go for the secret exit here. <laughs> Damn it! I lost my Aku Aku mask. That's not good when yeah, there's because, not. <laughs> yeah, because. Yeah, because if you if you hit a nitro plate in a bonus room, it counts it counts as dying, but it doesn't actually but it doesn't actually expend a life. Okay, now we're good. Now, now I can't possibly fuck this up because if I touch the nitro crates, I don't even have a chance to not be able to do the platforming. I am just dead. Right. Yeah, buddy. Hmm. Fuck this crap. All right, let's count. Four. Two. Uh. Uh. uh, uh <laughs> one. Two. Three. Four. Four. Five. <laughs> uh, counting box hits. We've missed you, Crash Bandicoot. Mm, that is a tight jump. Yeah, it's pretty tight. Who else is your tight as your mom? <laughs> mm, oh, come on. Do we need to devolve to my uh, to my mom jokes? We, my mom is amazing. We really should, and, and your mother is an amazing lady. 
Jeeva wishes my friends happy birthday whenever I remind her that it's their birthday. Woo. And go. And booyah, box gem for us. Give me that shit. Give me that shit. Give me that crown. Fly. Uh, All right, so present cloud, where are we off to next? We're gonna dig it, I think. Yes, because digging it is on the right, and that's the engine boss, okay. and that's the engine boss layer on the left. Engine is one of my favorite bosses in this whole game because it actually looks like Crash is throwing Wumpa fruit, not just having them spell from his belly button or something. Okay. Okay. Oh, all right. Are we doing ruination or being hit or behaving instead? Yeah, I think I want to play. As, I want to play as Coco for a little while. So, in order to okay, get so into ruination. So we are not going to take the green gem pathway. We are going to get the box gem because there are no boxes on the green gem pathway. Okay. One thing I failed to do is it was to get the some of the some of the more humorous idle animations from Coco. One thing, one big missed opportunity with this. She answers her cell phone, she makes, she sends emails, her fucking computer overloads and self-destructs, which is hilarious to me. You did not need to kill the armored gecko, dude. Leave no traces. These guys really are just walking back and forth. I mean, look, this, this guy is, is, this is him, this is his gymnasium. He jumps. And there's a, is it a one up or an aqua aqua mask? Oh, look up. Aqua aqua mask. Okay, now material, materialize the nitros and use the quick timing to get ahead of the hazard. Nicely done. Thank you. And now it's through the fire and flames. God damn mm, I really like that segment in uh, Brutal Legend, honestly. Brutal Legend is a game that I really wish that I could actually I could actually do for the channel, but I don't think it ever got a PC release. Not that it would actually benefit that much from a PC release, aside from the uh, multiplayer community. The very last hero game that I played was Guitar Hero 3, and I think the last song that I played was either Threes and Sevens by Queens of the Stone Age or Lay Down by Priestess. Two very good songs. Mm. Whereas I'm still exploring Clone Hero. Although, admittedly, um, uh, Clone Hero didn't do their uh, mon their uh, monthly set, uh, set list update yet. So, um, all, all, what they did instead uh, for this month was they released a uh, uh, a up on, on, on upgrade to version uh, to version 22. I'm not entirely sure what all is new is in the upgrade, but um, uh, um, the first iteration of it, it uh, it had a broken score saving system, <laughs> so uh, they they hot fixed that uh, like uh, about 12 hours after its release. Hey, nice break. Thank you. I miss the days when Guitar Hero World Tour and Guitar Hero 5 both had a music creator and a dedicated database where you could get you could basically get new tracks daily because that's how often people were putting up songs. Most of them uh, suck, but that they were new. Now for the record. Sweet. It's one of the better reasons to actually uh, to actually get Clone Hero, honestly, because the community is, for the most part, really damn good. Goddamn monkey. Yeah, missed time to spin there, Mr. Cloud. It's okay. Now all you have to do is survive the flames of retribution. Um, <laughs> is the color palette in Ru and Ruination different than what it God was in it. the uh, original? I think it looks more marble as opposed to uh, as opposed to ruined. Uh, but uh, in uh, uh, in this uh, in this game, whereas it was more, it had the same uh, the ruined colors uh, of the rest of the ruined levels in uh, the original release. This looks more marble, you know, like uh, like gray slash white scale. Yeah, I mean, it's hard for me to to make a comment on how ruined or not ruined something looks in a PS1 game because PS1 graphics in general just kind of looks dumb. Um, but. Uh, please observe that there may be an active filter on the image because if you look closely, the rain is splashing on the screen in the fourth wall. Hee <laughs> hee. Damn it! 
Come on, Cloud. You knew that that was going to happen. I knew it was going to happen, but what was that? What, what are you going to do when you got a slide and there's a TNT behind that guy? You time your prom a press on the TNT, you j then jump backward and let the explosion uh, kill the dude. Bull shit. <laughs> I'd rather waste an Aku Aku mask on that crap. Oh, look at that cute little mice! Oh, you didn't try. Me. You didn't try and hit it with the uh, with the rat. Damn. The rats are so oh, well. uh, cute. <laughs> they're they're actually the looking rats at are me. Cute. One uh, the rats uh, are actually kind of cute in this oh, game. Oh, it's log time. It is log time. Gotcha. Hey, you actually spun it that time. Sweet. I'm kind of surprised that you took damage on that first one, though. I could have swore that you were above it. You, you you think you think so, right? I mean, I spun. It was fun. I fucked up. Mm. All Woo. right, so next part we're going into digging it, right? Uh, I think so. Yeah, because the these two levels they will probably kill me a lot, and that's why crashes crashes the stunt is the stunt guy. He's he's the die guy. So in the next part, we're gonna die a few times. All right then.